Hello everyone. It's ya boy. Uh, don't really quite like that. I can't really pull it off, can I? Hello everyone. It's that guy who's slightly competent at Hearts of Iron 4, but still loses most of the time anyway, because you all set ridiculous things. So, today will be no exception, except I'm choosing something out of my own... Uh, bra brain? That's right, it's me, Alex the Rambler. And uh, today, what we'll be doing is a 1939 style. Oh, yep, that's right. And guess what? Well, you probably guessed because of the video title and thumbnail. I'm going to be playing as France. So, this should be... Uh, it's going to go badly. Okay, I don't expect to win this. But what I want to try and do is challenge myself to a cha to a challenge. You can tell it's been a few days since I recorded anything. I was in New I was in New York at a Total War event, and that also didn't go very well either. But you know, my aim will be to survive until the 14th of June, 1940. If I surpass that date, then I will be very happy, a very happy boy, indeed. So what we'll do, we'll so we'll just select France there. And we'll do it on regular difficulty. I will stick Iron Man mode on so you know, like, I, I'm not, I can't use the console cheats because people have accused me of stuff like that before, even when I lose. It's like, oh, he's got to be cheating. Well, 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 no, I don't know how. So. Stop. And I guess we should have historical AI focuses. Uh, let's, let, let, let's begin. Oh. Okay. Save and play. Right. So, let's take a little look at the state of the country. I only have 12 military factories. Really, France? <sighs> well, let's just get a ton more. Actually, you know what? No, let's not do that. Let's see where we have forts. Okay, well, that's a problem. I need to go down the defensive focus. Looks like we have some mountainous divisions to go up against Italy. I don't think that we'll require tanks, so we'll get them the heck out of Dodd. I will probably have to go for all of the offensive... No, that's the wrong one, isn't it? I'll probably have to go for one of the defensive doctrines, which increases our... Entrenchment, which will be very nice indeed. However, I don't think I have enough men against the Italian border. Bippity boppity bippity boo. France only gets free research slots because, of course, they're extremely hard working. Oh, we do. We are up to date with our infantry equipment, kind of, except we need that. And our artillery. Again, we're actually up to date with certain things. So, tickle with my tackle and call me Fred. That is quite impressive. I would absolutely love to change all my men to mountaineers. However, clearly that can't happen because I don't have the manpower. And I also don't have the infantry equipment or the towed artillery. So they'll just have to do their best. Oh, we do lack oil. But luckily, the United States will be our sugar daddy. I'm calling upon Drew right now. Help me, Drew. I'm being slightly optimistic here, but perhaps I could actually take down Italy. I was also planning on trying to plan naval invasions. But... I really don't have the troops for that. So I guess I've got up to free speed now. We are in August, and it looks like... Oh, Germany's doing the anti turn pack, so it looks like I've got a little bit... Oh, wait, no. Oh, they've already got the war... Oh. Oh, boy. So it looks like they're going to try and call me in. Don't really want to do it just yet. Haven't built the forts. Have not built the forts. Looks like I've run out of manpower. <laughs> uh, looks like I'm at war with Italy, and this could be a very short war. Everyone has more factories than me. Except Slovakia. Let's just try and get those built now. How long is that going to take? 11th of September. So it takes about a week to get level 2 forts. Right. Well, I guess I'll do that. We'll, we'll, we'll ban the communisms. Um, can't have that here. Sorry, sorry, Papa. Still haven't completed my defensive focus, which is a bit of a pain. How are we looking in the skies? Oh. Oh, well, okay then. Oh, look. It doesn't look like the divisions that I had assigned to this region are actually, actually listened to me. Looks like they're heading down there now, though. Pretty, pretty darn zippity quick. Pretty darn zippity quick. I'm hoping with these reinforcements, they might be able to hold a little bit longer. Well, it looks like I finally got the Italians on the, on the, on the back foot. Except I'm not, not quite because I'm not pushing in. But look at all those green numbers. <laughs> oh, <grrr. laughs> I don't know what's happening. As you can see, my national unity is only 35%. So if I lose any territory whatsoever. I am screwed. Fortress France, everyone. Just, just... Fortress France. Defence. Yes. Now, I'd actually bother getting more troops, however, my equipment in the field ratio is actually worse than it was before. Right, well that's not good at all, is it? Let's just send some more divisions. Oh, 
boys, stop attacking me, Italy. You're just, you're just being annoying. Okay, despite me plonking in tons and tons of divisions. Apparently they're still win- oh wait, no, I'm winning now. No, it's undecided. No, I'm winning now. I'm winning now. I'm winning now. Okay. No, 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 I'm not backing you, Benalu. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Benelux. Uh, <laughs> well, Luxembourg lasted all of a day. Brilliant. And looks like we are holding. Level 3 forts and level 1 forts are not going to be enough here. Oh, well, Italy's actually become competent and is not letting me encircle their divisions. Brilliant. They're doing Mare Nostrum. However, they have no navy. So, good job, Italy. No! Why would you assign? I didn't want to. <laughs> oh, God damn you, plonkers. I should just not be allowed to be in control of things. That's just, you know... Just take away control of my mouse from me. Because clearly, I, I, I'm basically my own worst enemy here. Fortress France. Fortress France. Now, if I'd have actually had time to complete Fortress France, this would probably be going a lot better than it is. But as a result of not having enough time, we only have level 3 and level 4 forts. The actual advance by the Germans didn't actually occur until 1940. So, really... Attention! This, uh, this, this scenario is unrealistic. I think as soon as I lose my fourth, then I'm... Uh, did I even inflict any casualties? I mean, kind of. In me. But honestly, Britain. I really needed Britain's help here. Oh, okay, well, my invasion of Genoa clearly hasn't gone as well as I'd have liked. Um, brilliant. Oh. Ho, 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 Oh, dear. Okay, well, this is just a complete and utter train wreck now, isn't it? This was my first time doing this particular scenario, so if you happen to have any particular advice for me for the future, of which I probably won't actually bother doing this again, please do let me know, because we all know this is going to work, don't we? Just build forts and it will be okay. Just like here. This is fine. Good news, everyone. I can do alpine forts now. Oh, oh dear. Well, I've survived to at least 1940. Looks like I'm getting absolutely cream craggered now. So let's 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 withdraw to our final fallback line and do a final stand. I don't even know if I'll like. I think I'll lose too many. Yeah, look at that. Look, I'm already so close to capitulation, and they aren't even at freaking Paris yet. Oh dear. I have got some forts though, so we might be able to hold in Paris. Well, Strasbourg, Fortress Strasbourg, right? Continue yes, just hold in Strasbourg. Many Frenchmen are about to die. Many Frenchmen have died. So, how many divisions have been destroyed? Not that... Oh, it's not that bad, actually. Okay. Oh, they're already making it past my final defensive line, huh? Brilliant. Oh, yep. Yeah. No, they're, they're, yeah, they, they full on are. They're just... Yep. Yeah. Okay. So, if you manage to do better than me, of course, feel free to send me screenshots. I... Couldn't, I could have not entered the war, but that really isn't the point of this scenario, really, is it? Actually, maybe I should have done that. That probably would have been a bit better. Oh, God. But you know what? No, I figured I'd have to enter the war when it all kicked off. Otherwise, that, that feels like I would have been cheating. But I would have had a lot more time to get my defensive stuff set up. Strasbourg is the real MVP. Stra Strasbourg strong. Strasbourg strong. Oh, God. Everyone... Attention. Get to parry. Hold the Germans. How the heck? No, no. You get back in Strasbourg. Well, it appears they're just going around Paris now because clearly it's it's too hard to take it. No, 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 no. Just stay in Strasbourg, please. No, no. Strasbourg strong. Okay, Strasbourg strong. Oh, oh. I'm almost in circles. Well, let's let's. <laughs> I'm not having that. Let's push them back, guys. Let's push them back. Don't worry. Don't worry. I think we can I think we can do this. Well, at least we had Valentine's Day. The 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 capital of, of romance survived, except now they're just all going around Paris because my line has completely collapsed. Just oh my giddy aunt at this stage. Look at that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Paris has been taken. There we go. France capitulated. But I still control Brest. And I just completed Alpine Falls. Oh my god. <laughs> but really, I think the MVP of the day was Strasbourg over here. Strasbourg is strong. Damn. But, you know, I, 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 I'm controlling free France right now, which is nice. We've still got 
Edward de -de 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 -de. We can rebuild. We can rebuild on my 20 factories remaining. Yep. Definitely did not get defeated. Definitely did not get defeated. But, of course, if you want to see me tr try to do this again at some point, let me know. Or if you've got any other 1939 scenarios, let me know too. Didn't quite win, but didn't quite lose either, because I still control free France. So, tickety-boo. That, that means goodbye. Many thanks to Ivan, Wyatt, John, Mike, Adam, Miss Lexicon, Random the Randomer, Nicholas, Travis, Sam, and I Sorry Productions for being ridiculous rounder supporters on Patreon, and many thanks to all the other patrons too.